We're here with Tufts head coach Lauren Epstein along with student athletes Kayla McCabe and Sophia DeCoco after today's um, 8 nothing six run run rule win over um, St. John Fisher. Coach, just initially your thoughts on today's uh, two games, actually. Yeah, I think any time that you get to play another day with your teammates, it's a great day. So I think we're grateful for that. Um, I think we played a hard-fought game this morning um, against a really good opponent and, um, you know, just didn't come out on top. But proud of the group for the way they responded. Uh, I think, as we said yesterday, we're kind of just focused on us and ourselves, and it felt like we had a lot of energy and we were having fun. Um, in both games today, I think there was moments in the first game that we um, – lost that a little bit, but really was just trying to get back on track with that in the last game, which I think um, they really did. So two good uh, opponents that we played today. Our regional is really competitive, so um, just proud of them for battling through. Um, Coach, you, as you said, you guys dropped that really tough game there to Rochester this morning. How do you kind of mentally refocus and come back against an equally as good team in St. John Fisher and, and, and get that win? Uh, I think, you know, they just stayed loose. I think they play some sack. They go inside and have a dance party. I think, um, again, those are just like two centering activities that make it more about us than the situation. Um, we've just worked really hard on our cohesiveness as a group and our ability to depend on each other like that. And I think that helps you going into those kind of situations more than physical skill would. Uh, Kayla, for you, you're a senior. And, um, you know, after this morning, you kind of have your backs against the wall a little bit. Um, how do you guys kind of come out? You get two immediately, you know, to kind of put the pressure on St. John Fisher. And what was the mindset coming into that second game? Um, I feel like we were just playing, like Ev said, very loose. Um, obviously, with a sense of urgency and, like, knowing the pressure of the double elimination tournament and having a loss on our record, but knowing that we can play better softball and the better team can win a lot of times. And so just playing the softball that we know we can. Uh, Coco, for you, I mean, you know, in the in the circle, you were pretty dominant today. I think you gave up three total hits. Um, you know, just what was working for you, um, you know, pitching-wise today? Yeah, I think just, like, resetting after every inning, taking inning by inning, batter by batter, um, knowing that the defense has my back, the catcher has my back, and just staying loose throughout the game and just having fun. Um, Kayla, for you, I mean, you guys kind of had a weird day yesterday. It was, the games kept getting pushed back and pushed back. You, you know, earn that win, then you have another long day today. How do you guys kind of, you know, put today behind you now and, and go in tomorrow? I think we've seen a lot of Rochester this morning. It was a long game. Um, we're going to use that to our advantage. We've seen the pitching. Our pitching staff is deep and better. Um, and I think we're excited to jump on them, make a statement, score more than two runs in the first inning, hopefully, um, and just – some on the board throughout both games tomorrow. Uh, Coach, for you, I mean, you um, saw some people really contribute all the way through the lineup today. It was kind of uh, everyone stepped up for you all, especially like Kayla comes in and gets two hits there in that second game. I just talk about the depth of your team, um, you know, especially offensively there. Yeah, I think we're just talking a lot about passing the bat and doing what's best for the team at that moment. So I think at that moment we were just looking for two out hits, um, and Kayla started off that whole rally in that last inning. Um, we're just looking to have quality of bats when we go up there, uh, and that helps the team. So I think our offense right now is really just focused on helping the team, passing the bat, getting the bat to the next person's hands to do their job. So um, just keep trying to do that. Um, I guess, Coco, for you, last question. Just, you know, confidence momentum going into tomorrow. How do you guys feel, you know, after today's uh, couple games? Yeah, I think did a good job of like celebrating all the little things and um, any big plays or big hits we like get hyped off of that. Coach as always you let you have the last word um, in any interview I uh, just final thoughts on today. Uh, yeah I think obviously like um, there was highs and lows of today but just proud of the group for ending the day on a high they're excited to come into tomorrow I think um, our conference tournament is a double elimination so to play in a double elimination tournament um, we know that it will be a grind whether we're in the winner's bracket or the loser's bracket so um, I think they're just ready to come out and battle tomorrow. Uh, noon tomorrow against Rochester. Uh, tough scenes to win twice to earn the regional championship coach. Uh, Kayla and um, Coco, thanks so much for your time. Good luck tomorrow.